Kids need a rest. We can just sit here and enjoy this beautiful day. Hmm. Maybe we should take a break. You think? There's a bench waiting around the corner. <sighs> What bench? <sighs> hey, look! Someone's moving in. Basketball? A soccer ball? A bicycle? Una pelota de baloncesto? Una pelota de football? Y una bicicleta? Sí. Yes! I bet they have kids! Wait! ¿A dónde vas? Where am I going? To welcome our new neighbors, like you said. I didn't say we should welcome them. Well, whoever said it, it was such a great idea. It's probably me. Now we need something to break the ice. Red, mm, to land. Toothpaste, Ooh, too personal. Foot powder sends the wrong message. <gasps> uh -huh. Can we go over there, Abuelita? Si, sí. vayan. We'll be right back, Abuelita. Welcome, neighbor. Uh, thanks. My name is Maya, and this is my brother, Miguel. Hi, I'm Andy. Where did you move here from? Wisconsin. Wow, we've never been there. Our mom's from Mexico, and our dad's from Puerto Rico. But we've lived here all our lives. Do you know where you're going to school? Right down the street. Cool, that's where we go. We brought you a gift. Children's chewable vitamins. Yes, they provide the recommended daily allowance of 13 vitamins and minerals, all wrapped up in a delicious grape flavor. It's something you can use every day. You get used to her. Eventually. Vitaminas! I can't believe you gave him vitamins. It's okay, Miguel. You can't believe a lot of the stuff I do. He probably thinks we're a bunch of weirdos. Then again, you know what they say. If the shoe fits... Very funny. Think about how Andy feels. He's in a new house, a new neighborhood, a new school. He doesn't know anyone. We have to make him feel welcome. And nothing says welcome like chewable vitamins in the shape of farm animals. Okay, it might have been a bad idea, but now we can do something to make up for it. Something big, something fun, something... SOS! Oh, no. We'll start planning immediately. The food, the music, the guests. Guests? What are you talking about? A party! Una fiesta! Una fiesta? Exactly! Una fiesta? We're throwing a party? Not just a party, an extravaganza! Fun, fun, fun! We'll need a cool theme. <gasps> oh, yeah, old-fashioned burro skirts and varsity jackets. Or medieval knights and dragons and princesses. 
or ancient Egyptian with pyramids and hieroglyphics. Wait, 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 wait! Guys don't care about poodle skirts and stuff like that. Let's do something we all like. How about sports? SOS, Miguel! A sports theme! Yeah! We could put different types of games all around the community center. Basketball and soccer and volleyball. And you gotta admit, that does sound pretty cool, Miguel. All right, I'm in. Perfecto! Now let's get moving, people. We have an extravaganza plan! Bicicleta, sí. Check. Soccer ball. La pelota de fútbol, sí. Check. Basketball. La pelota de baloncesto, sí. Check. We're all set. Hey, this place looks great. Fantástico. Has anyone seen Maggie? Help me. Maggie, what happened? <laughs> that net's alive, I tell you. Para conmigo. Mm, it's after seven. I wonder where Andy is. I'm sure he'll be here any minute. We should get ready. Okay, everybody. Make sure you shout welcome loud and clear when... Sorry, I'm late, guys. Well, well... Come. Uh, I got lost. <laughs> Mira, tiene solamente un brazo. He's lost one of his arms. Whoa, someone lost an arm? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding, guys. Hi, everyone. I'm Andy. Hi, Andy. I'm Theo. And this is Chrissy and Maggie. Nice to meet you. Wow, this place looks so cool. Did you guys do all this? It was fun. Everyone helped. Even Tito, Linda helping her. <laughs> Quick, Miguel. We have to do something. Right. Helping of rice and beans. Mmm, -hmm. delicioso. Who's up for a quick game of bat? Maya, what are you? Sorry, I um, I saw a big hairy spider. I didn't see a spider. You don't want him to feel embarrassed or left out, Miguel. How do you think he's going to play ball? Hey, do you know what would be fun right now? Singing songs. Really? Because there's so many cool things around here to... Oh, no archery. Someone could lose an arm. Uh, eye. Un ojo. Um, lose an eye. You know what? Let's all dance instead. Buena idea. Let's dance. Does everyone know the Frankenstein foot dance? You know, where you stomp around using only your feet. Oh, yes. The Frankenstein foot dance. I love that dance. Come on, everyone. Stop! You have to. 
to help me figure out how to fix the disaster. Disaster? What disaster? The welcome party. Five more minutes. Cinco minutos más. Miguel, this is serious. We need to make Andy feel comfortable. Comfortable? Bed. Come on, Miguel. Please help. I'm worried that he thinks we don't like him because he has one arm. Let me sleep on it and tell you what I think in three hours, all right? You're making the face. I can feel it. I can't sleep when you're making the face. Ah, I give up. I'm powerless against the face. Gracias. Now please help me think of a way to make Andy feel welcome. Well, okay. Let's see, um, you could, uh... I think having so many people together at once might have been just too much. Maybe we should have a smaller group. Bueno, that's... And since we're making it a small group, like maybe just you, me, and Abuelita, who makes everyone feel comfortable, we should do it at her apartment. Hey... She could cook her famous tamales for us. Thanks for your help, Miguel. Mwah! Gracias. Thanks for inviting me over for dinner, Senora Elena. Ay, por favor. I love to cook for guests. Uh, can I help you with anything? I see. If you want to help stuff the corn husk for the tamales. No. No? No one stuffs corn husks like you, Abuelita. Andy can stir. Sure, okay. But if you have any vegetables that need chopping, I'm your guy. No corn husks? Abuelita, can't you see? Andy has only one arm. Solamente tiene un brazo. How do you think he can stuff corn husks? Please, don't make him do things that will be difficult for him. Pero Maya, él parece estar muy bien. He's fine, mija. Please, Abuelita. We can't even imagine how difficult life is for him. Don't make it any worse. Everything okay over there? Just chatting. Keep up the good work. Table's all set. I'm ready for tamales. <gasps> I know. This is terrible. ¿Qué pasó? Did I put the fork on the wrong side or something? ¿Qué estás haciendo? We can't leave all that silverware on the table. Andy won't be able to use it all. The knife and fork cutting things. He'll feel uncomfortable. What are we supposed to eat with? Chopsticks! You only need one hand for those! Yeah. Where are we gonna get chopsticks? ¿Necesitas algo, Maya? No! Gracias, Abuelita! I don't need anything! So, Miguel, that was a fun party at the community center. All that sports equipment. It's too bad we didn't get to use it, huh? Well, uh, you know, my friends and I, we're not only into sports. We like to, um, we like to talk a lot. Yeah, talk. Well, sometime I should teach you some sports. I love sports. I used to be on the baseball team at my old school. Really? You were on the baseball team? Oh, so, uh, were you on any other teams at your old school? Abuelita, this is delicious. Yes, Senora Elena, everything tastes great. And these chopsticks are so different. <laughs> I always say, dare to be different, right? Your teeth are green. Maya, ¿dónde están mis cubiertos? I didn't think we needed knives and forks, Abuelita. I think I may need a knife and fork if I'm going to enjoy any of my dinner. <laughs> oh, I feel a little sick from all those popsicles. Ugh. I think you might be taking this sensitivity thing too far, Maya. Andy can do a lot of things. Did you know he was on the school baseball team? He was probably the manager or something. I don't know. He said he really likes sports. Miguel, why are you playing sports with him? What if he gets hurt? I didn't play sports. I just talked about sports. 
I guess talking about it's okay, but what if it just reminds poor Andy of what he's missing? Please, just give the athlete thing a rest. But I can't go on forever without playing sports. Por favor, Miguel, think of Andy. Okay, okay, I hear you. Sheesh. A perfect day for playing some basketball. Maya said not to play with Andy, but she didn't say anything about playing solo. My basketball. My soccer ball. I guess I need to take better care of my stuff, but at least I can still go for a bike ride. My bicycle. No. No, she didn't. No, no, no! Maya! <laughs> I wasn't gonna play sports with Andy. I was gonna play by myself. Ay, hermanito. I'm sorry, I didn't think of that. What about my skates? You don't need arms to skate. And if Andy falls, how does he catch himself? Okay, what about soccer? You're not even allowed to use your arms in soccer. And let's say Andy wants to play goalie. What about that, Smarty? Maya, did you ever think that if Andy wants to do it, then maybe he can and he's fine with it? Hey, Theo, you're playing basketball? Yeah, just shooting hoops. You mean she didn't get to this one? Who? Oh. Maya, she's ruined all my sports stuff. Whatever you do, hide this in a safe, secret place, or she will. You need to loosen up, man. Are you up for a game? You know it. Hey, guys, getting ready to play some hoops? Uh, actually, we were, we were gonna, um... You mind if I play? Uh, you know we play pretty hard. <laughs> That's what you think. Okay. Let's see what you got. Miguel got me thinking that maybe I've been going about this all wrong. I really want to make Andy feel included. He seems so smart and nice. Maybe we could bob for apples and then we play to 11? <gasps> hey! Andy and Miguel are playing basketball! I thought Andy wasn't supposed to play sports. Maya, where'd you go? <laughs> I have to stop them! <laughs> I won't bring out my killer crossover. That would be way too harsh. Hey, quit talking and play. I don't want to wait forever for the next game. What is that? Maya, what are you doing? Oh, uh, hey guys. I, um, I joined the band. Oh, uh, Maya. Now you've officially gone way massively majorly overboard. What's that? <laughs> I can't take it anymore. <laughs> Andy, what's wrong? All oh, the trombones. Oh, how I want to play the trombone. <laughs> Cut the music. Cut it. Now see what you've done. You made poor Andy feel bad about not being able to play the trombone. I am so sorry. I'll get them out of here right now. Yeah, get him far, far away. He looks pretty broken up. Further! Further! You know Maya already, Andy. Let's just say I've got lots of experience with people trying to figure out how to act around my, uh, disability. Now, you ready for me to wipe the floor with you? You can try. Amigas, I was trying to make everything all right, and I made everything worse. Please, can you... The bus is here, Miguel. What bus? The one that just took you to school. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Bring it on, Santos. In your face, Blandy. No. 
nothing but net. Miguel, ¿qué haces? Hey, remember the guy you told me not to play sports with? Well, you were right. He's mopping up the court with me. Did you see that shot? But I... But what? Andy's finally doing something he likes for the first time since he moved in. In fact, it's taken everything I've got to stay ahead of him. Ah! Santos makes a brilliant comeback, pulling it out in the end. Good game, bro. Thanks, man. Hey, don't get a big head. Next time, I won't go easy on you. <laughs> yeah, sure. Hey, maybe we should get Andy to play with us in a three-on-three -three tournament. Oh, yeah. Together, we'll be unstoppable. Andy, are you okay? What's up, Maya? Sure, I'm okay. Your brother's really good at hoops. Yeah, I know. He can be a bit much sometimes. Are you kidding? Your brother's the first person who's treated me like a regular kid in forever. What? But I... He actually played against me instead of letting me win. Nothing makes me feel better than that. Next time, though, you better watch out, because I'm getting serious. I've decided what our next activity should be. Does this mean we're not going to bob for apples? I have something I want to give you, Andy. More vitamins? <laughs> no, a real welcome present. A baseball glove. Cool. Gracias. <laughs> Thank you. Let's play ball. <laughs> Andy's no different from any of our other friends. He just wants to hang out and have fun. Come on, Maya, you can do it. Keep your eye on the ball. Now Maya actually treats Andy like everybody else. Don't you worry. I'm sending this next pitch into another time zone. Yeah, well, you're going to have to hit it first, Santos. Enough talk. Give me your best stuff. exactly how he likes it. You got lucky, Andy, and you know it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop talking and start hitting, Maya. Well, then you show me a real fastball, Andy, unless that was the best you got. Oh, that is so not the best I've got. Just pitch it. All right. Pitch it. 